said, on behalf of the Global Nutrition Council and the global nutrition community, we want to congratulate you on your receipt of the Evie McCollum International Lectureship in Nutrition Award. It's very well deserved. The, the role that you have played in the lives of so many scientists in terms of both thinking about the numbers, thinking about the analysis, thinking very rigorously about those, those analytical elements and simultaneously holding onto the human elements as well. You have been an amazing mentor to so many, and we are pleased to send you these virtual hugs because we can't give you the hugs in person. Congratulations again. Congratulations, Edward. It's not bad for a little skinny kid with big nerdy glasses who thought the idea of fun was putting food coloring in the sugar bowl. Not bad at all. Bye. Hi, Ed. Congratulations on your award. I can't believe it's been 50 years of love and admiration for my big brother. I'm so proud of you, so happy for you, and so pleased that you've made such an impact on so many lives, not just within your circle, but around the world. Congratulations. Talk to you soon. Once upon a time, Grandpa did an awesome job. The end. Congratulations! Hi, Dr. Frangillo. Congratulations for this very deserved award. Thank you for everything that you've done for the science. But overall, thank you for being such a great mentor, such a great friend. And um, seriously, I'm super grateful that I have you in my life. And congratulations. Congratulations, Ed. I'm very proud of you always. Your knowledge is spreading in all the Latin American countries, in Medellin, in Colombia, uh, in Venezuela, and all the Latin American countries because you are very a kind person, a very protective, and I'm always telling you this. Uh, thank you, thank you, thank you. Congratulations! <laughs> Congratulations, Dr. Frangillo. I'm thrilled that you're receiving this award. And yes, so much so that I put up a banner for you. I just wanted to say real quick, from the bottom of my heart, thank you so much for being such an incredible mentor. I have grown so much as a researcher and as a person in these last couple of years and largely because of you. You've really inspired me and you've pushed me and challenged me and I just wanted to say thank you for all your support and guidance. Hello, Ed. We met over 30 years ago. Can you believe it? <laughs> you were first my mentor and very soon you became a very dear friend. And through all the years, I've seen your work I've seen your passion to guide students, to help them grow professionally and personally. I've seen your commitment to increase our knowledge and understanding of key issues in health and nutrition for the well-being of so many people, so many groups, so many communities all over the world. I recognize your vast knowledge, your deep understanding of key concepts and issues. So I wanted to join the many voices that gather through this video to celebrate this award and to celebrate your work. From Costa Rica, with love and gratitude, well done, Ed. Congratulations, Dr. Frangillo, on this prestigious award. Very well deserved. Your contributions to nutritional science are so impactful, and you have gone above and beyond to mentor and advise so many of us. A huge congratulations. 
Hello, Ed. A uh, big congratulations from Vietnam. Uh, I'm very grateful um, to have you as a lecturer, a mentor, a professor, and a friend. Uh, I hope that you can do more for the nutrition professionals worldwide. Uh, and um, if you have a chance, please come and visit us in Vietnam. Uh, thanks again and be safe. See you, see you again. Hi, Ed. Congratulations on receiving this wonderful and deserved honor. Thank you for being a mentor, a colleague, and a friend. Big congratulations from me. Take care. Ed, congratulations on your award. It's very well earned. Not only do you continue to make tremendous contributions to the field of nutrition, but you're also a very supportive and thoughtful mentor. And I feel very lucky to have you as one. Dear Dr. Frangelo, congratulations on your well-deserved the McCollum International Lectureship Award. Wishing you all the best. Hi Ed, congratulations! I am so happy and proud to see that you're being recognized for the valuable contributions you have made for so many years in the field of nutrition and for guiding so many of us along the process towards professional careers and current improving nutrition and overall well-being with so many different populations and in so many parts of the world. Thank you for your unwavering dedication Congratulations, and I hope you enjoy this. Congratulations, I'm so happy that my best mentor won this award. I'm sure that everyone knows you deserve it. Congratulations again. Hi, Ed. Congratulations on winning this award. Uh, I'm really happy for you and proud of you. Uh, I'm so sorry that we cannot all meet at ASN this year as we have in many many other years before um, but hopefully sometime in the future anyway um, I also wanted to say thank you for your support and your mentorship um, you are truly a role model for me in many many different ways um, and I'm really grateful um, for your mentoring during my masters and then when I did my PhD, you were <clears throat> incredibly supportive throughout the distance, so I'm really grateful for that. Um, I, yeah, I hope um, you like this video. It'll be fun to um, see different people, I guess, even if it's um, virtually on a screen. <laughs> anyway, I hope to be able to see you soon. Um, Maybe you guys can, you and Marguerite can come visit Connecticut, although it's a little far, but we'll see. Um, all right, bye now. Congrats again. Hi, Ed. Congratulations on winning this award and on always inspiring people to bring out the best in themselves and do good things for the world. Big hug from Mexico. Hi Ed, many congratulations to you on this award. This is a very well-deserved award and really telling of the immense breadth and depth of your contributions and really the impact in the field of nutrition. I am glad I could be your student and learn so much from you. I think you've been instrumental in the success of many in the field of pub uh, public nutrition. Um, and I'm really grateful uh, for all your continued mentorship. Um, very proud of you. Congratulations once again and enjoy. Congratulations, Ed, on your well-deserved award. You've always been an incredible researcher and, most importantly to me, a great mentor. I'm wishing you the best and continued success. Congrats. Hi, Ed. Um, I am happy to join nutrition experts around the world to celebrate your contributions to advanced global nutrition. Uh, big congratulations for this well-deserved award. Um, I am honored and I am thankful because you are my mentor. 
your guidance and support for 21 years now uh, have helped me perform my best even in the most challenging situations and I am truly thankful. Uh, I wish you continued success. All the best to you always and big congratulations, Ed. Hello, Ed. Uh, this is Simon from Dakar. I wanted to congratulate you for your award. Uh, you are making us proud today. Uh, your work as a scholar has contributed to an advanced, advanced institution. But beyond that, as a mentor, you have contributed to shape the life and professional career of many of us. Uh, thank you and uh, wishing you all the best. Hi, Ed. First, I just want to say congratulations on this well-deserved honor. Um, I think I'm echoing others in saying that, that your impact as a mentor and a scholar cannot be overstated. I know that I and many, many others turn to you to help navigate life's twists and turns with great admiration, trust, and respect. I want to note that the community that you've built and continue to build and foster is an influential one. I believe that all of us have been activated in our professional careers by your relentless pursuit of technical excellence, but perhaps more importantly, by your uncanny ability to remain grounded and to ground others in the big picture, in the so what questions that define the work that we do. Um, I just want to close by saying that um, in having you in my life as a mentor and a friend, I really don't think I could have been more fortunate. Thank you for everything, Ed, and congratulations again. Dear Ed, you are super educated. When grants come, you're the man, and you're cool and calculated. You roll with it all, and you're not discombobulated. Spurs up! Hi, Dr. Franzillo. Congratulations. We are so proud of your work. Today, I'm very glad to extend my warmest congratulations to our uh, lovely and wonderful uh, mentor, Dr. Franzillo, for receiving this award. Congratulations and best wishes for the future. Congratulations on this well-deserved honor, Ed. I can't think of anybody else who um, should get this award who has impacted so many lives. It's a true honor to call you a colleague and a friend. With his collaborative spirit, in-depth understanding of nutrition issues and incredible technical expertise, Ed has led and guided pioneering nutrition research around the world. He has this amazing capacity to communicate or translate technical findings into implications for actions and messages that are well understood by people outside the field. His research has influenced policies and programs, contributing to the betterment of nutrition around the world. Ed, thank you for advancing our understanding of a wide array of nutrition topics, and thank you for guiding and inspiring us with your example on commitment and passion for nutrition. Congratulations on the very well deserved award. Hi, Dr. Frangelo. Congratulations on winning another prestigious award. I'm very proud of you. Hello, I am Tatiana. Hello, I'm Silesiana. We want to congratulate Dr. Frangillo for the hour. Congratulations, Dr. Frangillo. Congratulations, Dr. Frangillo. We also want to thank him for his support. Thank you, Dr. Frangillo. Thank you, Dr. Frangillo. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Hi Ed, congratulations um, on being honored with the E.V. McCullough International Lectureship in Nutrition Award. Congratulations on this great achievement and your wonderful research career in international nutrition, in U.S. domestic nutrition and food security. Um, not only are you a great researcher, but you have served as a great mentor, um, imparting your knowledge and experience on so many of us. Um, and so I personally thank you for your mentorship and your guidance um, and congratulations again on this achievement. Hi Dr. Frangillo, congratulations on your award. Thank you for being someone we aspire to become someday. 
I'm very grateful for all the generosity that you have shown me with your knowledge, with your time, and all the great advice you have given me so far. Thank you. Dr. Francillo, congratulations. You so well deserve. Thank you very much for everything you have done for me and for many others in our journey of learning and professional development. All my respect and appreciation to you. Thank you. Ed, congratulations on this award and thank you for all you've done to advance nutrition research around the world and train future nutrition researchers. Congratulations, Ed, on your well-deserved receipt of the E.V. McCollum Award, recognizing your invaluable contributions to the advancement of nutritional science and public health. It is a great privilege and pleasure to have the opportunity to work with and learn from such an experienced and knowledgeable scholar such as yourself. Thank you so much for sharing with me some tidbits of your vast statistical knowledge and broad scholarly wisdom. And thank you for your many contributions to the advancement of sound, nutritional, and global health research. Hi, I'm Trinidad from Hermosillo, Mexico. I would like to congratulate Dr. Fongilo for this award. It's really appropriate the distinction for being a great researcher with a lot of social sense. I feel very proud uh, to share project with someone who has been for me a great mentor, who has given me his, his wisdom with great simplicity and sensitivity uh, like you people. I am very pleased with your recognition. Congratulations Dr. Fangelo again. Your awards makes me feel very proud. Bye. Congratulations on the award, Ed, both from me and from Baby Aziz. He's very proud of you as well. Um, well deserved. Uh, it's an honor to work with you. It's an honor to to call you a colleague, a friend, um, to have been able to work with you for so many years and to be impacted um, um, by you in the research that I do and, and, and being a part of the research that you conduct. So, congratulations. Um, well deserved, and I look forward to the work that we have yet to do. <laughs> Hello, Ed. Congratulations on uh, the McCollum Award. It is truly a, a well-deserved uh, honor for a, an individual who's contributed so much to the programs in international nutrition and global health. Uh, your uh, contributions over a span of nearly 40 years are really quite remarkable. And uh, uh, we at Cornell are very, very proud that you were we started this journey here in the Ithaca campus and have extended it to a remarkable uh, career uh, up to and including your University of South Carolina appointment. We, I look forward to hearing your uh, McCollum lecture when it finally goes online and wish you the best success as you continue your, to make your contributions in the areas of international nutrition and global health. Good luck. Ed, congratulations on this prestigious award. What I've always admired in you and your work is its transboundary character. Your record in international nutrition is clear and outstanding, and this is the work being recognized by this, this award but you have an equally impressive record in domestic nutrition issues. So that's one of the boundaries that you cross and you cross them so easily. And in both settings, at home and abroad, you are at ease working at community level, national level, and all levels in between. You have remarkable skills with a wide range of quantitative methods, qualitative methods, and impor most importantly, the ability to combine the strengths of both within a single study. While most of your work relates to social and behavioral aspects of nutrition, you know when and how to bring biological considerations into the picture. You've conceived, designed, and implemented an enormous body of research of your own making, 
but you also have been enormously generous and valued as a collaborator by many colleagues, myself included, and someone who consistently improves the quality of our research. You've applied this rare combination of talents and skills, not only in your research, but also in your teaching and public engagements outside of academia, as well as, and most impressively, in your generous, gentle, and caring mentoring of students and colleagues. This is beginning to sound too much like a retirement video, and I know you're not retiring, so let me stop there and save some material for some future occasion. Suffice it to say, congratulations, Ed, on this supremely well-deserved award. When we were in Amherst, you were looking around, thinking about what was the best field for your life's work. You were looking for a subject that would always be important. You observed that since people always needed to eat, nutrition would be a promising field. Congratulations, Ed, on winning the McCollum Award. It's definitely well-earned recognition for your positive contributions to international nutrition. You've been amazingly productive. You applied your analytical mind to designing interventions and evaluating their effects in various parts of the world. Your insights have inspired students and collaborators and have influenced nutrition policy. You've been mentored many students and junior colleagues who will have lasting input in international nutrition work. Yay, go Ed. Ed, congratulations on receiving this award. You've been leading and mentoring students and other scientists for a very long time, and uh, you're really deserving. Your leadership uh, is an inspiration, I'm sure, for many others. And congratulations once again. Dear Ed, congratulations on winning this award. It is so well deserved. I wanted to say thank you for all that you've done for our field and for the many students, including myself, that you've mentored over the years. Congratulations. Ed, congratulations on your award. This is a good time to tell you about some of the many things I appreciate you for. I appreciate you playing the straight man to my jokey self on GNC calls and in other situations. And I appreciate it when you finally do crack a smile. I appreciate you for introducing me to the concept of food insecurity way back when, when I was TAing in Rebecca Stoltz's class. I really appreciate what you've done for the measurement of water insecurity and for some choice words at some critical junctures in my life. Your intellectual rigor tempered by common sense and a commitment to the health and well-being of the most vulnerable is just a paradigm. Thank you for all that you do. Hello, congratulations on the award. Very well deserved. Good nutritioning. <laughs> Congratulations. Congrats. Love you.